Hey guys, so today I wanted to make a video about how in Shopify you can make a hoverable drop down menu for your, your header of your theme. For the purposes of this video, I'm going to be using the Dawn theme as a base, but you actually can use many of the free themes on the theme store since uh, the vast majority of them are actually based off of Dawn. So the code that I provide will work on those as well. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. In your site's admin, you're gonna wanna come down here and click on online store. Uh, so as I mentioned, for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm gonna be using the Dawn theme, but any of these themes that you see down here should actually work as well with this tutorial. And so then before editing your code, if your theme isn't already integrated with GitHub, which I cover how to do in a separate video, which you can find linked in an annotation here. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and either download your theme file or duplicate your theme. And so that way you'll have a backup in case the changes are breaking. They shouldn't be, but uh, it's always good to have a backup. So after you've done that, go ahead and click this edit code button here. So now Shopify is gonna bring you into the online theme editor. Go ahead and collapse all the folders that you see here and open the assets folder and go ahead and click add new asset. This is where our script is gonna be located. Uh, we're going to go over here, click on create a blank file, and then change the extension to JS. And for the file name, go ahead and type menu dash dropdown and click done once you've typed that. So this is gonna create a new file in your assets folder called menu dash dropdown.js. So go ahead now and scroll down to the pinned comment on this video. It'll have a script there that I want you guys to go ahead and copy and paste. So here's the script here. And essentially what the script does is it's grabbing all of the relevant items that are either menus or submenus, and then iterating through them and basically recognizing when mouses roll over them. And when they do that, it's going to set attributes on them that will open up those menus. Okay, now what I want you to do is we're gonna go ahead and have to actually link this script when the header section is included in our theme. So to do that, uh, go ahead and go up to the search files here and type header. And you'll notice that uh, header.liquid pops up in the sections folder. Go ahead and click on that. And it's not super important where you include this in this file because of the method that we're using, but go ahead and right here, open up a little bit of space and go ahead and copy paste the second code snippet in the pinned comment on this video. And so that's gonna go ahead and look like the following. Now go ahead and make sure that you've saved both these files. And when you preview your store now, you should see that the hoverable drop-down menu works. 